Israel confirms Lebanese reports of downed drone. Gaza shipwreck survivors plea for entrance into Europe. 1,200-year-old Sidor penned in Hebrew is unveiled for the first time. And Prime Minister sends Rosh Hashanah greeting via WhatsApp. Shalom and welcome to the Jerusalem Post News. Today is Sunday, September 21st, and here are your top stories. A Lebanese news station released a video of an Israeli drone that crashed in Lebanon over the weekend. The plane was flying across the northern border on a regular surveillance mission Saturday morning when it fell from the sky. Media outlets in Lebanon first reported that a drone had crashed in the southern town of Marjayoun. The Beirut-based al Manar TV station, which is associated with Hezbollah, said the army had taken hold of the downed aircraft as it broadcast images of the Israeli drone. Ruling out the possibility the drone was deliberately downed, the IDF said a technical malfunction caused the crash, adding that it was further investigating the incident. Hundreds of Gazan migrants were rescued from the sea off the Italian coast this week as the increasing flow of desperate refugees continues to try across the Mediterranean. A video released over the weekend shows three Palestinians from Gaza describing the horrific plight on September 18th after surviving a shipwreck and seeing hundreds of, the fe of their fellow shipmates die in front of them. Some 500 people are believed to have drowned earlier this week after their boat was rammed by a people trafficking ship when the Palestinians refused to change ships at sea. The recent war with Israel has swollen the number of Palestinians in the Gaza Strip, joining an exodus of migrants fleeing the Middle East and Africa in search of a better life in Europe. The world's oldest known Jewish prayer book went on public display for the first time on Thursday, joining the Book of Books exhibition at Jerusalem's Bible Lands Museum. We're very excited to have this artifact, which is virtually priceless uh, for us at, in Israel, in Jerusalem, at the Bible Lands Museum as the uh, celebration of the last month of the Book of Books exhibition here at the Bible Lands Museum. The prayer book, or Sidur, is an estimated 1,200 years old and made up of around 50 pages of Hebrew script. According to the museum, it is still in its original binding and originates from the Middle East, though research on it is ongoing. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu tweeted New Year's greetings to soldiers and citizens as part of his four-minute videoed Rosh Hashanah message to the country this weekend on YouTube. Sounding a bit like he is in election campaign mode, he summed up the passing year saying it was, quote, especially challenging for Israel. Israel tzomachet misvivenu, hi chazaka yoter mikol chesronotenu. Yachad, bekochot meuchadim umlukadim, נמשיך את שרשרת הדורות שאהבות אבותינו ריחנו. נמשיך לבנות את המדינה שלנו, נמשיך לשמור ולהגן עליה. שנה טובה, בטוחה ושקטה לכולנו. And that's all for today. Don't forget to go to jpost.com and check out our Facebook page for more on these developing stories. Until tomorrow, shalom from the Jerusalem Post Studio.